The painful experience of living with a troubled feline friend can lead to sleepless nights and even terrible fights between family members. We love our cats dearly, but sometimes a little rain must fall. It can turn happiness into despair and delight into frustration. We struggled mightily to understand why our cats suddenly develop negative behaviors. Along with their charming antics and mysterious ways, cats can bring a unique set of challenges to our lives. And when these behaviors appear, it leaves us scratching our heads. The best weapons to have in your arsenal are simple, understanding, and a lot of patience. With those weapons, you and Kitty can work through just about anything together. There's a reason behind all troubled cat behaviors, and as cat parents, it's our job to figure it out. So join us as we highlight the adventures and possible remedies in the world of understanding and nurturing a troubled cat. Let's start with furniture scratching and other destructive habits. This one requires a tremendous amount of love and patience. It's the battle against your cat's need to redecorate your home by scratching your new furniture. But fret not, for in the grand tapestry of cat ownership, this is just another fascinating chapter. You see, our cat babies with their adorable yet pesky scratching habits are simply following their natural instincts. This is why we can't have nice things. <laughs> Fear not, dear frazzled friends. We have a few new tools in our arsenals to assist you here. Start with scratching posts set up around the area. Place these furniture saving devices where Kitty is doing her work. Then, when she goes for Grandma's antique sofa, you gently redirect her. No yelling, just redirecting them to the acceptable place to scratch. Remember, scratching is a part of who your cat is. So if you don't want Grandma's antiques destroyed, redirect the behavior to where it's acceptable. If your cat doesn't immediately take to her new scratching post, there are sprays that you can buy that will attract them. Another way to reduce damage is with regular nail trimming to dull those sharp claws. And let's not forget our top secret weapons, double-sided tape and citrus-scented sprays. Cats do not like either. These additional tools should also discourage their mischievous redesign of your beloved furniture. Next, aggression and hissing. Have you encountered the drama of feline feistiness? There are various triggers, but if the behavior persists over a long period of time, it might be health-related and should warrant a visit to your vet. Now, if your kitty is fine, there are many other reasons for aggressive behaviors. It could be a family member, another cat, or another pet who also lives in the house that can be causing it. These behaviors, while startling, often have deeper roots from fears and stress to a battle over who reigns supreme in a household kingdom. Cats have their reasons for going on full hiss mode. But we've got a few tricks up our sleeves to help bring some peace back into your once happy home. Start with slow, steady socialization techniques. Create your cat some safe havens in a few areas around your home so that they can get away from whatever is causing them the stress. There are pheromone sprays that you can buy that mimic a chemical that cats emit through the glands on their face when they're feeling calm. And if all else fails, have your vet prescribe medications that will calm Kitty down. There's always a reason for this behavior. And while it can be disruptive and frustrating for everyone, remember that your cat is suffering too. As difficult as it might be to do, be kind and patient with them. Otherwise, you're only adding even more stress to the situation and your problem will worsen. Is your cat timid? The elusive disappearing act of our cautious kitties. Just like humans have different personalities, so do cats. If you're living with a very timid or shy cat, you'll discover that they seem to have a secret hideaway under every nook and cranny in the house. Yet, behind the curtain of shyness, lies a tale of unease and worry in their furry little minds. There are many ways to increase the self-esteem in your cats, but the good news here is that one of the most effective ways to give your cats some much needed mojo is to simply play with them. Cats are natural born hunters. There are plenty of great toys on the market to stimulate your cat's natural instincts. 
Not only will this play slowly bring your cat out of its shell, but it's also fun. So spend some quality time playing with your cat multiple times a day if you like. There's no such thing as too much play. Do this a few times a day for a few weeks and watch your cat's attitude begin to change. Consistency. It's the marvelous world of kitty predictability and routine. Cats revel in the comfort of a structured routine day. One can imagine that it has something to do with living in the wild and not really knowing where your next meal was coming from, or even if they will be prey for a larger animal's next meal. So stability and routine, while might be a boring way to live for some humans, is heaven for our feline housemates. Brace yourself with the magic recipe that'll turn your cat's world upside down in a good way. Think of it as a daily cat planner, complete with meal times, play dates, and designated nap hours. This simple routine isn't just about being orderly, it's about crafting a haven of peace and tranquility for our troubled friends. The more stable and predictable you can make their lives, the happier yours will be. Another great way to reduce stress is to enrich their environment and create a little playland for them. You might think you're spoiling your cats by surrounding them with things designed to make them feel like little kings and queens they deserve to be, but this isn't the case. Quite frankly, it's truly the opposite. You aren't spoiling them. You're helping them lead a life more similar to the way their ancestors lived in the wild. Living in the wild would be anything but boring. Compare your lifestyle to your indoor cat's lifestyle. Remember, hunt, catch, kill, eat? That is their inner cat, what your cat has inherited from the wild cats that came before them. Boredom can easily set in, and that is the root cause of so much disharmony in a home. Don't be afraid to pick up some interactive toys that tease their playful spirits. Puzzle feeders are a great way to turn mealtime into an exhilarating quest for food. Big, tall cat trees, or even cat shelves, are gateways to a vertical adventure land where your cat can reign supreme. It's the magic wand that wards off destructive tendencies. So let's immerse ourselves in the realm of endless fun, transforming our homes into vibrant wonderlands that tickle their senses and spark joy in their hearts. Let's talk about proper health care for a moment. The key to our cat's wellness and happiness is regular visits to their veterinarian for thorough checkups and wellness evaluations. These vet visits also serve the greater purpose to uncover any sneaky health concerns that might be brewing. Remember the wild cat in our house? Well, his instincts are to hide when he's feeling sick for his safety in the wild. So don't expect your cat to let you know that he's not feeling well. It's all about showering them with the love and attention that they deserve. My cats especially love chin scratches and cozy snuggles. Mental stimulation becomes our secret weapon, unlocking the gateway to their blissful state. You need patience with cats. The art of being a cat whisperer, a noble endeavor that calls for a ton of patience and empathy. Our cats speak to us in whispers and hints. Observe them with the keen eyes of a detective, deciphering their tail flicks, subtle meows, and telltale purrs. Each moment spent in their company unveils a new chapter in the book of trust and friendship. This may seem like a lot of work, but it's really not. It's about spending enough time with your cat to get to know them and to understand what their body language is telling you. Cats are very communicative, not in English, and not like a dog at all. Invest the time in understanding a cat's body language, their tails, their expressive eyes, the way they walk, the sounds they make, these are all you need to know to understand your cat. And it's all about positive reinforcement. Positive reinforcement techniques, such as rewarding desired behaviors with treats or praise, can be highly effective in modifying a troubled cat's behavior. However, it's crucial to avoid punishment, which can only exacerbate fear or anxiety. The roller coaster of raising a healthy cat with a unique personality is like embarking on a captivating adventure where challenges weave themselves into the fabric of our everyday lives. But the rewards that await us far outweigh the effort to make them whole. It's all about seeing your troubled friend not as a puzzle to be solved, but as a soul yearning for understanding and connection. 
Dive into the depths of your cat's individuality to understand their wants and needs. Patience becomes your loyal companion on this voyage, while positive reinforcement acts as the guiding light, illuminating their path to joy and contentment. But here's the not-so-well-kept secret. There is no one-size-fits-all. Each cat is a unique personality. With unwavering dedication, show some kindness and love, and you'll witness the transformation of challenges into triumphs. Thank you for hanging in there this long. We hope you found value in this information. Drop down in the comments section below and share your stories with us. We'd love to hear both the successes and your failures. Have you ever considered how being a cat guardian can help you through a mental crisis in your life? Watch this video and I'll see you there.